guys, yesterday in social studies, you learned from Mrs. Lanning about the place we are in the world when, where we live in Missouri. So let's just do a quick review. We live in the Northern Hemisphere or Western Hemisphere. Okay? Then we narrow it down to the next largest section, which is a continent. We live in the continent of, the, of North America. So this is all North America, all this green, including the United States. Okay, next. We're going to look at the United States. The United States is one country in the continent of North America. As you can see, Missouri is the darker blue in the middle. Today, we're going to look at Missouri being in the middle of the country, but we're going to look at all the states that touch Missouri. We call those the surrounding states of Missouri. So today, we're going to focus on the surrounding states. Now let's get out this packet that you did yesterday. Yesterday you labeled the hemispheres, then you labeled the continent of North America, then you labeled the United States, we lived in the United States, and now we live in the state of Missouri, which is one state in the United States. Let's turn to the second page. On the second page, we're going to learn the eight bordering states. We are only one of two states that have the most states that border it. Tennessee is the other state and they tie us with eight bordering states. Okay, today I'm going to teach you a little trick on how to remember the states. Okay, but first thing, let's label them together. I'm going to use abbreviations, okay, and you can use the same abbreviations that I do. Okay, the first thing I'm going to label is I'm going to label the state of Missouri. So I'm going to label it with a capital M and a capital O. Okay. Then I'm just going to go to the top of my um, list. Okay. I know it looks a little funny because it's written as a song. Okay. My first one is Illinois. Illinois comes, is right next to Missouri. It borders right next to St. Louis, which is on this eastern side of the state. So Illinois is a capital I and a capital L. Okay. Next we're going to do Kentucky and we're just going to go all the way around the state of Missouri. So next we have Kentucky, and I'm going to abbreviate that, capital K, capital Y, and you're going to do the same thing. Okay. Next I have the state of Tennessee. Okay. Here's my next one, Tennessee. It's capital T, capital N. Next I have Arkansas, which is a capital A, capital R. Make sure you're doing this with me. Okay. Then I have Oklahoma. It's a capital O, a capital K. Okay. Now let's do Kansas. That's the other state that's right next to us. It's just about 10 minutes away from us. That's a capital K, a capital S. Okay. Right above Kansas, but touches Missouri, just in this corner, is Nebraska. It's capital N, capital E. It's Nebraska. And finally, we have Iowa, which is right above us. Capital I, capital A. Okay, I'm going to use these states up here, our surrounding states, and teach you a little song to help you remember where the states are in relationship to Missouri. So we're always going to look at Missouri as a center state. Okay, and I'm going to sing this song. I'm going to kind of point around as I go around. Okay, the song is an old time song. Okay, but it, we're using different words to the tune. Okay, it goes Illinois, Kentucky, Tennessee, and Arkansas, Oklahoma, and Kansas, Nebraska, Iowa. I'm going to skip this part down here, but if you practice that song, you can rewind this and practice it a couple times by yourself. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is we are going to color our states. Okay, you're going to do this on your own, but I'm going to get you started. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to color the state of Missouri yellow. To kind of highlight it because for us, that's our most important. So you're going to finish coloring this yellow. Okay. Then you are going to go around and color each state a different color. You might pick blue for Illinois, but you can choose. Okay. You might pick a green. I'm using colored pencils but you can choose to use crayons or colored pencils. 
Okay. Make sure you color in the whole state and then each surrounding state a different color. Take some time after you color to re-practice the song so it helps you remember what song or what states surround Missouri and the order of them. If you always think when you do Missouri, see Missouri, the one next to it is Illinois, and that's the order you're going to follow. And just go all the way around. Let's do that one more time. Okay, it goes Illinois, Kentucky, Tennessee, and Arkansas, Oklahoma, and Kansas, Nebraska, Iowa. Do a couple rounds of practicing your song after you finish your coloring today.